The Sand Bar and Grill is a place for great food, great fun, and a great island atmosphere. Whether it's burgers, lobster rolls, or refreshing shipyard beer, and the Sand Bar has something for everyone. The Sand Bar is also known island-wide for the best high-end sushi. Located right in the harbor, enjoy a relaxing shipyard brew as the sun sets. A Sand Bar has everything you need, all under one roof. It's an awesome beach bar. Located in Oak Bluffs Harbor, this is our 13th summer. We established it with the theme of Key West and a place to come on uh, Martha's Vineyard where you can get away from it all. Tucked back between everybody but still looking out over a beautiful harbor. People come just to chill. Joining us now is Jordan, owner of the Sandbar, who's sipping on a nice shipyard right now. Jordan, tell me a little bit about the concept of this bar. Well, we're the only beach bar in Martha's Vineyard. We have a cranky nightlife and an unbelievable daytime atmosphere right here on the sand. We also have, hands down, the best sushi on Martha's Vineyard, arguably on the East Coast. It's uh, you know a sushi beach bar with great appetizers, unbelievable cocktails, and the Orca Bar, which is the best oyster bar, the coldest beer in Oak Bluffs Harbor. That's right. I just actually ordered a Philly roll myself, and it was delicious, so thank you very much. I wanted to know a little bit about your specialty rolls. What do you offer that another sushi place wouldn't? We have a pretty eclectic selection that you can view online, but what you should do if you come, whether you're from Boston, New York, Philadelphia, come down, ask Kevin Chong, the sushi chef, what would you make Jordan? He'll make it for you. Oh, yeah? Can you give us a little uh, sneak preview? We've got spicy tuna wrapped in salmon. We've got cucumber wrapped in you know, tuna. We've got every single thing that you could possibly imagine. And if we couldn't, you could. Tell us what you want and we'll get it to you. All right, what's your personal relationship with Shipyard here? Well, I suppose my personal relationship with Shipyard, other than the fact I really enjoy the beer, is Jason Donati, who's an unbelievable guy that comes down here and he throws the best party on Martha's Vineyard here at the Sandbar. We give away trips to Portland, we give away all sorts of unbelievable prizes, shirts, hats, Captain's Club gear, which is an unbelievable uh, store at the top of the street. Second year here on the island, cheers to Jim Tatro, AJ and Paul, my partners on the Captain's Club Clothing Company. We like to think that we're a full service operation, your guides to the vineyard here. So we're here to take care of you with whatever you need. We've got car rentals, we've got bike rentals, we've got electric bike rentals, we've got clothing. We got a liquor store, we got a laundromat. So if you get your shirt dirty drinking at the bar, we'll take care of you the next day. Whatever you need, we got it here at the sandbar. Cheers. Well, all right. Well, Jordan's taking care of that. We're going to send it over to Emmeline over at the Orca Bar. She's going to talk with Cameron. Emmeline, what's going on? Thanks, so. Well, what's up here is we're here with Cameron at the Orca Bar, and he's going to be making us one of his special concoctions tonight. What we're going to start here is called a Banana O'Reilly. Now, it's going to be a very alcoholic drink. It's going to be kind of heavy, so we use the banana liqueur to keep that in there. The Jameson, another two ounces, and then four ounces of the Irish cream. Someone's gonna look at this and say, why am I putting so much alcohol into a drink? That's why we have fruit juice. You only want an ounce. Shake it up. Wine with the chocolate sauce, strain it. Oh my gosh, this is so good. Especially with the chocolate and banana, you can really taste the strong chocolate and banana flavor. Exactly. Cam, thank you so much for taking the time to talk with us. No problem. All right, well, you never know who you're going to run into here at the Sandbar. James Paxton, everybody. James, tell us about your new movie that you're working on with Vince, ba Vince Vaughn. Well, that's a tongue twister. Yeah, it is. Well, it's, it's a new thriller called Term Life, actually, with uh, Terrence Howard. And uh, it's coming out in October. It's, um, I, play, I play Vince Vaughn's uh, daughter's boyfriend. So <laughs> it's, it's a fun one. I'm a BMX biker. My hair is down past my back. It's going to be good. And not only <laughs> are you an actor, a successful actor, but you're an oyster shucker. Tell us a little bit about your other role here on the vineyard. Well, Jordan Wallace is my oldest friend on the vineyard. I used to come every summer when I was 16, 17, and 18. And I would work. I worked at an ice cream sh shop up the street on Circuit Ave. And Jordan's family kind of took me in when I didn't know anybody. I, I still live on Jordan's couch for the summer. He and I are working on a screenplay. But I, he got me some part-time work uh, as, a, as a, a mother shucker here. I've been shucking for four days. Love yeah, I'm coming for the record soon. I'm coming for the record. Well, that's awesome. You, you got a shipyard shirt there. You like shipyard? Yeah, I love shipyard. That's what we got on draft here. A lot of, lot of people come to the Orca Bar wanting shipyard, so yeah. Give them what the people All want. Right, yeah. There we go. I don't think I'm going to be able to chug this. Ah. Right, I'm going to sip it. Sip it with my pinky up. Thanks for joining us Thank here today. Thank you very today. much.